one of the mandates of the church is to go into the community. And one of the first steps that we are, are doing since I've been the pastor here at Rock of Ages is we are uh, uh, unveiling our community garden. Uh, one of the things a community garden does, it revitalizes the neighborhoods. And one of the things that we want to be as the church is we want to be the agent of change to help revitalize our neighborhoods, build a bridge because Rock of Ages is set in between the Southgate apartment and the Fairview Nursing Home. We want to build a bridge with our seniors and provide our seniors um, some creativity and some recreation to be able to plant and cultivate the land, but we also want to use this as an educational tool for our young people and work on youth development, work with the Toledo Groves, Toledo Botanical Gardens, along with City Councilwoman Brown, who I'll introduce at this time, who was with us for our unveiling. It's a pleasure to be here because we're in the middle of farm country, yet still kids don't know how things grow. A lot of adults don't, they go to the store and buy it and that's it. But what we would like to do here is something that Martha Captain tried to do, and that's to educate people how things grow, to come together, get their hands dirty, and then taste the wonderful food that it's going to produce. You're next to one of the uh, senior homes. They can come over. Seniors love to work in dirt. So they're going to enjoy themselves. You can have the schools come in. It'll be a nice project. Especially at a time when we have economic problems, our dollars are, are being stretched. This is an opportunity to plant and to reap the benefits of what we planted, especially at a time when you have the unemployment rate high and people just don't have the extra funds to be able to purchase uh, produce. This is, is going to be exactly what our community can use to revitalize and begin to think again on how we can go about going into the community and taking something bad but making it good again. Hello, my name is Leslie Talley, and I am the site manager for the Rock of Ages Falls Crestview Community Garden. We want to make this a very unique project, and so I've decided to outline a path and the design of a cross, and make it very symbolic. There will be the ties will represent the cross. It will be in the shape of a cross, and at each of the points where Jesus would have been crucified, we have red flowers that will be symbolic of the blood. At the gate will show that he is the entrance into eternal life and hope and peace. And we will also have uh, as many things as possible that will represent Jesus Christ. We are very excited about what the uh, garden will do for the community. We'll have educational processes with the Toledo Botanical Gardens, uh, we hope to have people from um, Southgate Woods Apartments be with us, Winterfield Venture Academy, and of course the community all helping in. We look forward to a successful program. Uh, it's a lot of work that still needs to be done. We are excited that we can get it done, and in a few years we'll have a very productive garden. Okay, and you've had some, some, some support from the local community already, correct, as right. far as some of the things I'm being donated? I'm very pleased to uh, talk about the fact that I've utilized many of the community uh, businesses, like Creative Stone, Falls, Crestview Market, uh, Mr. Harold Fall did the tilling, s, s Building Supply, helped us with the sign, and the city, of course, has made donations, and it's been a very uh, productive venture. Thank you.